Wow, we just watched uh, The Big Short, and let mm. me tell you, I am ready to pretend I know everything about yeah. the, about finance. Credit swaps or something? It's a movie about my dick. It's called Credit, Credit Wife Swap, and it's hey. where Adam tries to make money by letting people fuck his ass. <laughs> Whose wife Who's is he? Wi wi You're, the wife. <laughs> yeah. You're the wife. You're the wife. The guy swaps his wife for your ass. <laughs> yeah, I trade. <laughs> Adam invented a financial. What he did is people trade their wife to Adam to fuck Adam in the ass, and then Adam gets the wife. Sells the wife. Yeah, Adam uh, sells. Then he, the wife puts smart on business. a strap on yeah. him and fucks him. And then yes, the wife fucks him also. And then, then they steal the money he got from selling her pussy. Oh, well, it's all part of my business plan <laughs> to, lo to lose money. Oh, yes, bitch. Speaking of business plans, so I reached out to Casper Mattresses because mm -hmm. I know they sponsor a lot of New York podcasts and asked them to sponsor mine in exchange for a mattress, and they ignored my email. So <laughs> fuck that company. That's yeah, the official stance of me. I got a tough fuck. needle mattress. Fuck Casper, Which bitch. is uh, all right. You know, they didn't give me a free mattress either. What the Fuck, dude! We should get a free mattress. Well, what There's a hundred mattress companies. I, what I want now that I a hundred. Like, I didn't know <laughs> at least. <laughs> oh, nice. At least a hundred. There's a hundred mattresses. <laughs> you know what the fuck I'm talking about, bitch? What are you laughing? There's a hundred fucking in a box. Stop. I've said that there was one hundred mattress companies. He just means a lot. Have you never heard? An <laughs> estimation in your life before? I think there's more. You think there's more than a hundred? Listen, I just watched the big short, so I don't joke around about numbers. Yeah, here's a number for you. S five, five and three quarters. Suck my dick. That's a <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the inches that are going to go in your ass soon. Yeah. Here's the number for you. Hmm. Three fifths, and that's what slaves were counted as during the three fifths compromise. Anyways, you know? uh, yeah. so, but I'm looking at Marriott, Scott. Oh yeah, you want to buy nice sheets, huh? Well, no, I mean Marriott has the whole bed, and I figure if you're going to spend fourteen hundred dollars on oh, one, that's for the bed, one set of sheets. No, that's just the bedding. The bedding is thirteen fifty, right? Yeah, if you go to shopmarriott.com, you click on the Marriott bed. <laughs> wait, Marriott has a store? Yeah, dude. What else they yeah. got in there? They got little little bottles, robes, of shit? probably robes, probably those slippers. They got fucking jizz Terry everywhere. Cloth shit. Every hotel remote is definitely covered in jizz, right? Mm -hmm. For sure. Here's my question. Why can't guys wear juicy track suits? You know I would be all the fuck over that. Yeah. Why not? They don't make them nice. in my size. Which I would is, wear a juicy I guess they better. make velour track suits for men. Hold yeah. on. Which is better, inner spring mattress or a foam mattress? Spring, I, I, I mean, think. It's personal I, preference. I, I, it's personal preference. I have a foam. Do I have a foam? You have tough to needle, right? Either Tuft and Meadle or Casper. I don't remember. I threw one away because I thought I had bed bugs. They're foam. Okay. Yeah. Those are foam. I mean, those are like... Inner, you get those online and they're like rolled up. I feel like you fuck better on a spring mattress. Why? I don't know. I, th I, I just feel like I have. I don't know. I feel like a spring mattress is kind of like a waste of space almost, right? If you slice it like a, like a piece of cake... There's a ton of air on the inside there. Yeah, but oh, here you go. Get that spring, that nice yeah. bounce. So when you're here's for the platinum stitch skins. bed and bedding set from shopmarriott.com. Mm -hmm. You're gonna choose the mattress type. We we'll go foam size. We will go queen. Mm hmm. I don't know. You don't need a king. Adam bed sexual. Uh, you're, gonna, you're gonna be. F you're a fucking idiot. Orientation. Why, dude? King would be nice. You're like a king in, in a king. New York you need City. a big bedroom for a king. That's true. Yeah. I mean, yeah. We don't. We don't have the space. But why they? Why is it called California King? That's my uh, question. Because it's a different shape. It's it's bigger though, right? No, it's a different shape. It is bigger. A regular. It's longer. It's longer, but a regular king is four inches wider. Mm. Oh, it's, it's, it's California, California King California is narrower. King, California King swaps four inches out of the width for length. Interesting. Oh. Um, but then there's also a Texas King, which is extremely rare, and it's like <laughs> three times the size of both. Oh, of that's them. real. I thought you were gonna say it's like it executes retards or something. Uh, no, that's any that's any bed. <laughs> yeah, they get caught up in there. They can't get out. No, so <laughs> wait. How do they sleep <laughs> if they get caught up in the bed? Upside down, standing uh, up. Oh, so like bats, from yeah, like yeah, like like vampires. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they go they go out at night and they suck candy out of vending machines. <laughs> yeah. I want to suck your candy. <laughs> I, 
<laughs> you Twizzlers. Suck your candy. <laughs> My uh, name is Dracula. <laughs> <laughs> the retarded Elmer Fudd who thinks he's Dracula. <laughs> oh, oh, it's me, Dracula. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, dude. This is a real good one. <laughs> I want to well, see how specific. We're three minutes in, dude. I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't bank on it. So $3,400, you can get the whole thing. And I feel like a dummy for wasting my money on a tough to needle mattress. Yeah, dude. When I could have been living like a like a business like, yeah, like, like a, a guy a traveling on his wife. salesman going around town. You know, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll stay at the Marriott. <laughs> I yeah. used to stay in the Econo Lodge, but I got HIV there one time. <laughs> I got taken care of, but boy, I tell you, never again. No more Econo Lodges after that. How did you get it taken care of? Don't worry about it. <laughs> I don't have it anymore. I've decided. You know, I mean, that's the thing about the, yeah. That's miraculous. Do you know who Ray Sharkey is? Mm -mm. He was a an actor from the 80s but he had he got hiv from sharing needles back when it was like gays only oh you know? damn pause keep your mitts off hiv straight guys yep this stuff is gays <laughs> yeah. only. uh ray shark got it and then his agent was like all right here's what we're gonna do we're not gonna tell anybody not even women that you're sleeping with <laughs> so he was just giving people aids yeah he was giving like all <laughs> these women aids god forbid he put on a fucking condom man yeah. salute i mean i no, don't respect two what women he did. that he like killed. no that's oh, horrible Jesus yeah Christ. he's a murderer he really but the man is a murderer is committed to raw dogging yeah uh, it's i yeah. don't respect he gave, it. like he gave like one interview right before i would he never died, do it where, where they were like asking him they're like so you you were just giving people aids he's like ah, well the, the disease is a funny thing sometimes you have it sometimes you don't <laughs> I'm like no yeah <laughs> you just it's not diarrhea <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah. he's just in denial until the day he died that he you know he just damn he's convinced he didn't have aids We're going around at 75 pounds, you know? Adam, look, you might have AIDS, dude. Why? I mean, you have the body. Because type. I don't weigh a lot. Yeah. Have you ever had a venereal? Um, I don't think I'm so. I'm crystal clean, baby. No, Adam got it from sharing needles. Mm. From sharing estrogen needles with the, <laughs> the other fellas down at the clinic. From Sharon Needles? He fucked Sharon Needles, the drag queen. Yeah. Thank you. That's a RuPaul's Drag Race reference. No. Oh. It's a great show. I've seen it, I think, once or twice. It's very good. I was a contestant. <laughs> Lou yeah. Rawls Drag Race? Yeah. Lou Rawls Drag Race. <laughs> 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 Lieutenant Rawls Drag Race. Um, damn, bro. So, um, yeah, you're going to get a little bedding, you know? I just bought a fucking, I just bought a cold brew c container. That's, so that's pretty, that's nice. pretty oh, nice. Oh, yeah. We said we were going to review that. I haven't sure. bought it yet, but I just got it off Amazon, and it, it works great. So that's, yeah. a, that's a tax Duff write Needle sent me this free mug. Wait, seriously? Yeah. Oh, it's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. No, How I much just put, for I, $700? I just put the sticker on the my oh. mug. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you trick us so, Nicholas? I'm a trickster, dude. That's true. You you're you're Loki. We're entering, yeah, we're entering my, my, <laughs> my moon phase. <laughs> I'm a trickster moon. <laughs> I love all the trickster gods and shit. The Greek, the the little the little satyrs and mm -hmm. shit. Satyrs? Yeah, he was a uh, he was like a half half man, half goat, and he was horny as shit, and he was a trickster. He was oh. just like a little goat guy. He was fucking, isn't that Pan? Maybe it was Pan, but I think they're called satyrs. And uh, how about this Poon's Labyrinth? And it's about a vagina that twists and turns. Yeah, and, ah, yeah. interesting. You know, yeah. I've never seen Pan's Labyrinth, so. I think it's something about war or something. No, like about allegory. this. Pacific, oh, yeah, it is during the Spanish Pacific War. Rim, and it's about eating out a, eating an asshole. An, a, 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 a Hawaiian girl's asshole. Oh, okay. That sounds pretty cool. Yeah. I would like that whether it was a movie or just a th an These activity I got to do. Del Toro, right? Did he? Yeah, he made Pacific Rim. Pacific Rim goes yeah. off. I forget that. Yeah, that movie rules. How about Gay Queermo Del Toro? That's good. Yeah. Gay Queermo Del Homo. That's very good. Wow. Ryan Ryan Shut, my roommate, is uh, roast battling uh, Adam. Guillermo del Toro? No, Adam Amawala, and oh. I told him he should, he had a joke he should use is call him Adam Gay Koala. <laughs> <laughs> that is a good one, dude. Ryan's going to win that roast battle. Yeah. yeah. I call him Adam Gay Koala, be like, what are you sucking? Uh, eucalyptus flavored dicks? You fucking gay koala. <laughs> That's a good roast. You're really bad at roast jokes, dude. Huh? You can only do self-deprecating humor. You're bad at roasting. I don't like, yeah, I'm not good at roasting. Yeah. I mean, I had a couple okay ones. 
You're good at roasting. I'm okay at it. Yeah. Yeah. You're Stop fine at roasting. Up on stage and they're like, "Stop's fat." And Stop's like, "Ladies, I love chocolate." <laughs> and I'm like, is that a roast joke? <laughs> Um, I don't like roasting because I'm not a mean guy. I'm a cute. I'm a nice boy. You know. You you uh, you're good at roasting, like doing crowd work roasting. That's true. Yeah. If it's if it's in the moment, if it's if I'm. You're pretty good at funny moms last week. Yeah, that, that, that drunk was insane. That drunk woman. If you're out there, holler at me. You're my wife. Yeah, honestly, I thought you're were, you're were gonna smash. Afterwards. I already. I did. Yeah, I fucked you six times. <clears throat> So that's nice. that. The classic six time fuck. <laughs> One fuck for every bullet in the gun. The machine gun fuck, dude. Du, 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 du. Mm-hmm. Um, boys, I never really gave you guys the rundown from Greece, man. Don't you guys want to know about my magic? No, you tried to trip? do it three times and we've gotten bored. So I don't know if Okay, that's well, even guess what, bitch? I'm not saying anything anymore. Well, that's that. You know, yeah, I had notes so and everything. Tell us a story about George, you know. No, it's not about buying George. Buying shoes. He never bought shoes, so, you yeah. know? And I haven't seen you open a beer with your gifts, by the way. Adam kept shoving that thing in his mouth. <laughs> it's well, a I just have an oral fixation. <laughs> beer opener, and he's sticking the dick I don't know what you mouth. mean, little no. dick-shaped. I think it was... He said literal. Oh. I think it was pretty average slash small slash average slash colors large. too that's what a normal <laughs> dick looks like yeah like a seafoam green dick yeah like oh, a yeah. phoenix rising from the ashes yeah like ray sharky's phoenix dick <laughs> shouts out ray sharky he's the real ass dude of the week <laughs> <laughs> he's the real ass dude who's making those songs for Lewis? i don't know man <laughs> yeah we need somebody to make a a song for a thing I say in the middle of the show. Yeah, yeah. Not the theme song of the show. Just I feel th- like Lewis is really good at mobilizing people to do work for him for not a lot of money. Yeah. Like graphic design work and like I production work. pays people. Well, yeah, but I, I feel like he has like a dead. He's good Lewis, at Lewis is, Lewis is definitely good about paying people, but he's not charitable. There's a difference between the two. Yeah, oh, interesting. Sure. I pay people and I'm charitable. Like I give you guys money for shit that I should. Like what? Advertising income. Well, uh, come on, we get we should get advertising income. Yeah. Well, well I mean, yeah, certainly not the split that it is. We're selling our asses too. Yeah. You know. I want to do a read. I get, I get, a, I get a cut of all the money that Adam brings. In. Well, Adam doesn't touch any of the money. Yeah. When he I goes out on the street, the money comes to me. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta, he's got to kick up. Yeah. <laughs> his pimpin' ain't easy. Where's his taste? I'm sorry, Daddy. <laughs> yeah. Daddy needs his taste. Thanks, Thanks Daddy. Daddy. Don't call me that. Thanks for protecting me, Daddy. Thank you, Papito. <laughs> it's dangerous Thank out you, on papito. these streets. Thank you, Papito. Did you watch the pimp show yet? Which what one? Show? The uh, James Franco pimp show? No. No, I'm not watching that show. All right. Yeah, everyone keeps asking it looks me like to shit, review dude. It's the good. autistic doctor show. How, why Which, does it look like shit? I don't know. It looks weird. What do you mean weird? It doesn't look good. What the fuck do you want me to say? Yeah. Oh, those period, period, those, like, those period drama. Yeah, it's cheesy, dude. Recent. No. What is it? What's the, what are those called? Not it's good. Not period dramas, but like Mad Men or recent history period, period dramas. Period piece. Yeah, it's, it's a period, a period drama. Uh, I feel like that look has Mad Men does look They cool. have worn that out And now, I have an now affinity, the trick doesn't work anymore I have an affinity for anything that's said in like Shit New York Like 1970s like when it looked bad Yeah that's cool uh, I, I mean, like that Everyone that, that, that. That, that always gets cool. me. That's not cooler. I think that that American gets me. Hustle was the movie that sort of broke the American Ugh. Hustle that. sucked. That movie sucked my cock yeah. hard. I liked it, but I mean, I think well, how I did you like that? It. it sucked because it's a movie about con artists, and it's a movie that does everything it can to con the you. The mafia should have killed movie. them at the end, or whatever. I don't remember, but I, <laughs> <laughs> I remember I had a big issue with it. They got off scot free. They would have gotten got. Now, what's good about American Hustle is that it's a bunch of bad performances. Yeah, it was, uh, that's why I didn't like it. It looks like shit, and it's a gimmick, but that's like the kind of the whole point. They're con men, and the movie itself is a con. Yeah, listen, I don't want to. I don't need the whole movie to be making a point. You know, that's too much for me. That's I want to enjoy myself this. while it's going on. The biggest, the biggest play in the movie isn't like you know the heist with the chic or whatever. It's it's when you get to the end of the movie and. You let a bunch of critics tell you that Jennifer Lawrence is a good actor. Yeah. <laughs> she did the have the ultimate rube is you, the viewer, you know, and the critics that fell for it and said that movie was good. She did. Because have it's not good. If you're a critic and you think it's good, you're an idiot. You're a fucking moron for yeah. sure. 
But them, them titties were looking juice. She's hot, dude. In that, in that movie. Although I got pissed she off. She had him bouncing. I got pissed off that when scene I read. That where uh, she's dancing and singing, and the, the like improv house cleaning scene, is one of the most embarrassing things I've ever seen. <laughs> well, just being an actor is pretty embarrassing. It's pretty embarrassing, but they're like, yeah, she totally improv that. I'm like, yeah. It's <laughs> not surprising. It's a fucking jarring yeah. scene. <laughs> we improv this podcast. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we're acting. It, it looked like she was acting like a fucking asshole on the set, <laughs> and you just let her go. You know? Yeah. She really is too famous. Uh, I just, I don't like her because. Uh, this is a pretty misogynistic reason, but after the fappening leak, her like official statement. What? what pissed you're, me off. you're against that she didn't want people to see her fucking titties against her will? Yeah, she's an actress. Dude. That's rude, dude. She sells her titties all the time. No, but on her terms. Whatever. I it's not the biggest s- deal in the world. Uh, that's all I'm saying. All right, leak a picture of your cock. We're talking. Uh, we've leak a picture of your cock. Right now, tweet I'll a do that. It's fine. Well, I, I I'm do an feel she got treated unfairly because passengers, which I've defended on the show before, yes, you have. She was bitching about not getting paid as much as men, so she got like 20 million or some fucking outrageous number for that movie, like seven million more than Chris Pratt. Oh damn! And then everyone was like, "This is the worst movie that anyone's ever made." <laughs> well, that's why. No, I mean, the guy we talked about that um, we talked about it off mic maybe but the guy that did the fappening got like 15 years yeah in jail it's fucked up insane that I mean, is so long to go to jail yeah and you can't jerk off in jail 15 you'll be, years you'll beat the shit I mean out you, of you shouldn't steal people's fucking titties and pussies and put them on display that's not for why everyone. you got 15 years it was cause you got 15 years violating for Apple, humiliating Apple's Apple and, security protocol yeah. really yeah. yeah that's why he got it which is a point I already made to Adam, but now he's going to just talk over me. <laughs> it's stated as his own opinion. All right. Sorry. I won't talk again. I'm sorry. Thank, you can thank talk. God. Just don't repeat something that I told you. Well, that's why, obviously, why he got punished. It. Oh, so you invented that? Yes, I did. You're the uh, first person to say I that? I am the first person to say that. <laughs> no, it's just a fact. Is it a fact? Some may say a tidbit. We're a entering tidbit. Adam's fact corner. <laughs> this is, tell us more about the... The... the, the I'm, I'm paleo again. What? Sorry. <laughs> I'm being yelled at about the cat going through the garbage. Yeah, Phyllis is eating your, your ham garbage. Phyllis is a bum. I didn't put any ham. There's in. ham juice all I over. I ate all my fucking ham. Is there any more ham? I'm hungry. No, dude. Can I hate it all. I get, I get, I get the organic. Uh, you do the Applegate ham. Applegate ham. Ooh, I dice yeah, that. I get big dick soldier. I over put that here. in my breakfast, <laughs> Mister <laughs> Fucking Organic Ham. Well, that's uh, what they have at the that's store. That's the only shit they sell at the store. Yeah, actually. really. Yeah, yeah, the bodegas here is this like cross section of like the lowest know, garbage grade. shit, yeah, and yeah. then like you know. Uh, free range yogurt <laughs> for nine dollars. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. And it's dusty for some reason on the packaging. Yeah, yeah. yeah what dude, the fuck? Yeah, it. this fucking seltzer I just bought is like covered in dust. <laughs> Adam loves eating dust. Yeah, he's a fucked up bug. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck kind of insult is that? <laughs> You're a fucked up bug, dude. Bug. You're a ladybug with a <laughs> fucked up face up front <laughs> and not enough spots. Yeah, dude, there's ladybug. way too much red. You got ladybug. one spot. <laughs> Ladybug story. Everyone calls you, they call you the does. Indian ladybug. You got made fun the of. The reverse Indian. <laughs> <laughs> One black spot on your red body. <laughs> are there are there guy ladybugs? Yeah. That's you are. suck, dude. You Everyone are. thinks you're a girl. Yeah. That's what you are. They probably all have gender dysphoria. That's my new Jerry Seinfeld observational bit about ladybugs. Mm. Sorry, I tried to work that into the show this week. Is that a What's real bit? What's the no, deal really? with trans people? <laughs> <laughs> you can't cut your dick off. <laughs> That's wrong. <laughs> you sound like the guy from uh, the SNL yeah. Yeah. intro. Cardo. Here's me, Horatio Sims. Don't cut your dick off. That's crazy. <laughs> What's his name? G- Pardo? Don Pardo. Don oh, yeah. Pardo, yeah. Mm-hmm. He's, a, he's, he's a, a, a dick's supposed to be permanent. <laughs> a dick's like that tag on a mattress. <laughs> you don't know why you can't cut it off, but you can't. <laughs> Musical guest, Huba Stink. 
Nice. Yeah, that's a nice try. That's a good. No, I thought that I did better. Who are your nice favorite try. announcers? I think, you like my, I think my impression was actually better than yours. I'm not doing. You an do most. You do I'm most. Doing impressions Jerry Seinfeld. 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 He's doing Seinfeld. Oh, oh and, and it's spot on. Don Pardo. No, you said and that. His, that's Jerry how this whole. Hold on. The <laughs> this started by you making fun of him by saying it sounds more like Don Pardo. Now you're claiming I you thought that we transitioned seamlessly into a Don Pardo thing. <laughs> that doesn't sound like him at all. I thought that sounded pretty Daryl Hammond is now the fucking announcer because Pardo kicked the fucking. Yo, apparently Daryl Hammond. Hammond that, there's a guy who's got ham in his name. That's true. Daryl Hammond apparently Ham. his life is like yeah. real as shit. Else? Um, Mark Hamill. Mark Hamill. Mm-hmm. Hamilton. Alonzo musical. Hamburger Jones. No. No. Well, can, hamburger. No, dude. because no. that's it, that's the actual word ham. It doesn't make sense. Come on, man. What do you mean? Come on, man. You know why ham, it doesn't it's the work. Word hamburger. You know you understand why it doesn't his work. Name <laughs> is, <laughs> his name is not the criteria hamburger. that we that's were just doing. That's his nickname. fucking nickname. If oh, I was named okay, fucking so we, we have to do Dick Christian Jones. Name. Okay, sorry. I didn't know Not we had Christian to do our fucking name. Christian. Because mo- you're saying fucking stage names probably for most Hamurabi, of those guys. Hammurabi. Some, some guy named Hammurabi. They got there Hammurabi's code. That's not there an actor. Go. Who said it had to be actors? That's what we were doing. Just keep just up, now. Adam, all right? Me and Nick are doing a great bit where we're naming people oh who God. have ham in their name. <laughs> okay? And you're dragging us down, brother. Why are you I always think trying Alonzo, to ruin the show, dude? Okay? I'm, I'm, we're not even being mean to you a- anymore. Right, we, we stopped, stopped being that. Mean to you, and you're actively trying to derail the show by. You me. called me a ladybug who eats dust. <laughs> <laughs> I that said was a compliment. Up, you fucked up. I, I said was, you were a ladybug. Was, yeah, we were just <laughs> trying to name that's things. That's a compliment. That you are. Well, then thank you. <laughs> I, it's not an insult to say who you are. <laughs> yeah, that is what you are, literally. I'm not a bug who you eats are dust. A ladybug. Ooh, that's fuck. a mean thing. That's we're, we're a fucking little gas <laughs> bug. We're just holding a mic up to its mouth, and that's what you're. That's what you guys are hearing talk right I'm now. I'm not a bug. I'm the tall. Tallest cum boy. I tower over you. Both you, don't of ta- you. you don't tower over shit. That's why the anger, you the tower over Napoleonic the dust, anger that I get from you guys. Whatever, dude. From down in your down in. I will. I'm up here in the troposphere. Me and Kareem Abdul Jabbar. And You're short and ugly. I'm not short and ugly. <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tall and handsome. Nope. And I get more attractive every year. And every you year you get you fatter and balder. Don't. I get. He back. actually hasn't gotten fatter and balder. He's been the same. The bald same since the last been, three years. Yeah. <laughs> and he's gotten less fat. Thank you, Nicholas. Well, I got fatter, but I've lost half the no weight choice. I gained. You're ugly. You've always been ugly. You always will be ugly. That's not true. You haven't known me my whole life. I was way I've ugly. I've seen pictures. You were fucked up looking. I was butt ugly. I know. And now I'm cute. You're and not that cute. Now you can't name things with ham in them. Yeah, I dude. said Alonzo Hamburger. Oh, show. my <laughs> God. Dude, we got, we, I don't know how many times we're going to have to fucking correct This is you fucked this. up, dude. You're really Any, pissing anyhow, me the fuck off right now. We need to move on from this. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we, did, dude, we were trying to have a fun game to oh, kill time <laughs> with, and you fucking ruined it. <laughs> Let's see how long we can do. I mean, we were kind of running dry, honestly. I, I, I went for Hammurabi. Yeah, I think that the getting mad at me thing stretched John it out. Ham no, I'm that. tired of doing that. Anthony Hamiltop. Okay. That's a guy. Who's that? Anthony Hamilton. Shut up, dude. That's singer, not a person. Black yeah, singer. Yeah, he is. We already said Hamilton. Uh, so, if people keep asking me to review the show with the autistic doctor, that's which a show? I'm not going to do. Which show is that? Not, there's a show now where it's like that Toby from the West Wing is like, yes, he may be retarded, but he's the best doctor I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> and it's like, you know, he's Doogie Hauser, but he's, yeah, you know, he's got, he's got the mind child? of a child. Yeah. <laughs> Doogie Hauser MR, that's what I was calling it. <laughs> MR stands for mental retardation. In that's the, good. In the medical community. Yeah. Um, instead of Doogie Hauser MD, which is okay. the name of the original Doogie Hauser show. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You would think there would be an easier Doogie Hauser pun. Doogie seems like it rhymes with a lot of stuff, but it doesn't. Doogie, boo- sort of boogie. Amtrak Hauser? No. Mm, Amtrak? Uh, Amtrak. It's something train related. Yeah, yeah, because he's oh, retarded. He's, 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 he's retarded. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so the autistic doctor, he only delivers babies in elevators. 
<laughs> okay, that's there you good. Go. There okay. we go. That's a joke you could do about that show. You want to go ahead and repeat that to your friends, maybe? What uh, network is it on? Let's talk. You know, it's probably business. is it on like a major network? Yeah, it's on like CBS or ABC. Oh, that's autism nice. is huge right now. Everybody wants to have a show where Big an Bang autistic theory. guy does something not autistic. We, we remember when we were hanging out with those girls when we when we first moved here. And that girl told us about that show she auditioned for. Oh, yeah. That dumb, that <laughs> fucking dumb bitch, dude. I, I, I'm not trying to be a misogynist no, here. No, but, but she's what a stupid, a dumb bitch. fucking bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know. I mean, in like, a non imagine a dumb bitch. Way. That's her. Yeah. You know? Just yes. Come up with one in your head. I've got that's one. That's who this one, yeah. Oh, my God. Actually, yeah, I'm just in town for auditions. And this it's, this show's really cool. It's like, uh, she, there's, it's about an autistic guy that can talk. Talk to ghosts. Oh, I thought it was an autistic yes. girl that could talk to ghosts and then solves crimes. I don't know, dude. She's like a precog or something. She solves crime. I don't know. It sounded like the worst thing ever. And she's like, yeah, I think to it's the power really- of being autistic. Yeah, to talk yeah. to ghosts. Are they are they autistic ghosts? I think it sounds like a pretty good show, actually. <laughs> I would watch this show. <laughs> well, like, like what about us, being we were- autistic? I don't or know. is that just a coincidence? It, the, her autism gave her some what sort if of Superman, supernatural what powers. What if Superman was retarded? Hmm? That's Well, there is a retarded Superman. His name's Bizarro. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, yeah, Remember yeah. Remember Bizarro? Yeah. No. Bizarro's really funny. Bizarro is like... <laughs> Uh, he looks a fucked up. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he's like different, different yeah. planet. And he yeah, literally he's, does he's shit a, like that. Like literally a mentally retarded yeah, Superman. Yeah. That's he true. wears like a pendant around his neck that says number one. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the little other, the little alien guy, Mister Magazigazig or whatever. Yeah, Mister Mixapixelix. Yeah, or something. yeah. Mister Six. Yeah, that was a good ass show. That was Superman. The Superman show <laughs> yeah. with Dean Kane. No man, which that Superman? one was good too though. No, it's Terry a- Hatcher could. Uh, oh, that get was it. yeah. Terry Lois Hatcher and Clark dab. Yeah, uh, the Superman show that was like the same as the Batman. Yeah, yeah. Animated series. Oh, the, that was yeah, really animated. good, man. They yeah. got a couple of them the movies. The Batman animated series used to be super dark. It was like he was like sad yeah, all the time. Bye, yeah. Amber. Bye, Amber. What are you doing? Have a good night. I'm my dick wet. Nice, dude. Oh, Hell nice. Yeah. Oh, She's gonna hell fuck. yeah. <laughs> I love when my boys fuck. Yeah, uh, well, I'm not really into Batman or Superman or any of that uh, yeah, quote-unquote gay shit, <laughs> which I don't call it that. Other people, other bad guys say that. <laughs> Me, I'm open-minded, but uh, I've heard, I, in passing, I've heard, uh, while I've riding the train around, I've I've heard yeah. comic books be referred to as quote-unquote gay shit, which yes. again, I find. You've heard it in like in large hallways when the echo of you screaming yeah. the words gay shit yeah. comes and back really, to you. Really I, when cool I was doing the get it. kicked out of every New York library challenge, <laughs> going from one library to the next, calling the anime gay, <laughs> going into the anime section. So it's on record that I think anime is gay. At every yeah. library in New York, so no one can accuse me of secretly watching. So if anime. you, yeah, yeah, if you, if someone finds some accidental anime yeah. on your laptop, if somebody finds my a Netflix instant queue, which is filled to the brim with anime. <laughs> We're talking Ghost in a Shell. We're talking um, fuck Naruto. Yeah, the Ghost in the Shell listens to Come Town, huh? Scarlett Johansson, shout out. Our yeah. Fans. Oh, yeah. Our fans. Scarlett B- huge Johansson. Scar- shout out. We, fought, huge we all shout fucked out. her. I think. I don't remember. Don't talk boring. about her that way, stuff. <laughs> Please, do not talk about it. I don't remember. Did we? No, we didn't. F- no. We yeah. didn't fuck Scarlett Johansson. I, somebody got mad at me because I told I just a story want Scarlett about this to know guy. that I'm standing up for her right now. This guy that had a, a, a fucking poster of the notebook above his bed in his dorm at GW because he had a crush on Rachel McAdams but it's like that's not the fucking yeah. movie you pick mm-hmm. dude There's also so- don't have a poster in your room what are you like a fucking 14 year old girl you see he wasn't a dorm cool shit people up in, in college have posters like, though like, that, like uh, tools? they have the Bob Marley poster they have the yeah, yeah, Reservoir yeah, yeah, yeah. Dogs someone poster. who listens to the show said that they couldn't listen to the show anymore because that was their friend they just <laughs> happened to know the guy he was my my friend's roommate, and I made fun of him, and I think I mentioned his name. Guess what? Good fucking riddance. Yeah. Whoever's yeah. not listening, suck these fucking low-hanging balls. We have literally hundreds of Adam has listeners. some low-hangers. 
You've seen him? I've seen your nuts. Oh, when I bent over. You know what's yeah. really sad about when I lost my phone? My phone that got st- stolen in Baltimore? I had a beautiful video of, of your my balls. Ass. Yeah. And I wanted to edit together. Oh, uh, you got to use iCloud, baby. I am yeah. now. I am now. But I use iCloud. And then I can get fapping. My brand new Mac died. Bullshit. 10 months. Fucking logic board failed. Did you get a new one? Nope. No, I got to buy Apple Care because they just replaced the board and all this shit in there. And, uh, I mean, I'm assuming it's going to happen again because they make shit computers. No, they make good ones. You're the only Dude, person my, I've ever heard in my life have this Dude, problem. My, my, literally, every, my shit every has lasted since Apple 20, 2009. Has. I had that Toshiba. I got it for $700, and it's lasted years. It's slow as fuck. It's heavy. It's like uh, you can't take it anywhere. Yeah, it's like 20 pounds. Yeah, but, I mean, it, like that computer will never die. Yeah, I don't know. And man. I edit every show on it. Really? Yeah, I tried editing. When I was editing the audio for... Uh, 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 the the soundboard. Yeah, the soundboard. The fucking Mac died. Hmm. You know, just crashing, restarting. Mm, that sucks. I want to buy one. I want to buy uh, a Mac. You I get can't a Mac, have dude. this. I'm a professional a app developer. Dude. Yeah. <laughs> well, you got the I'm regular the Steve. Imagine if Steve Jobs were still alive. I I shoot him an email. I say, Steve, fellow innovator here. Yep. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm designing a Imagineer. soundboard app where my friend says things like Billy Joel and. <laughs> Whatever, man. This shit's Fava boring. Beans. <laughs> when did I say fava beans, by the I way? I don't know. Why did you say it that way? I have no idea. It's so weird. It was actually pretty cool, dude. I pulled your audio from one episode. and That was all one I episode? It, it was, I, yeah, I brought it into Logic. And then if in Logic, you can uh, strip silence and set like the thresholds and mm. like where how much of it cuts. And then it, it just... Uh, it just separates the entire your like track for the show into individual words. Ooh, yeah, or like individual statements. Little, so that's fun. Yeah, then I could just go through all of them, and I don't have to listen to all the fucking silence. And it was actually yeah. pretty easy to pull all that shit. But yeah, I don't know what the fuck you were talking about or why you kept saying <laughs> fava beans because you said it multiple times. Really? Yeah. Hilarious. A Le- cupcake and a candy bar. I'm sure there's a listener out there that's like episode 52, minute yeah. 11. In episode 4 FOB, Itchy <laughs> hit Scratchy's rib cage twice, producing two completely different notes. I mean, uh, what are we supposed to believe? This is some sort of <laughs> magic xylophone? <laughs> <laughs> uh fuck man I gotta take a piss You guys handle this without me it's, Oh it's, I don't know if we can dude It's rolling It's pretty Are we rolling doing a spot right on now this? This, is, this is the regular episode This is the regular episode Well you know what I'm telling you fucking pieces of shit about Greece Whether you want to hear about it or not man. I not uh, Because there's topics that we have to cover We like can get what? to make Greece a list thing at the end Hold on God damn it What oh, do we have fuck. to cover? Oh Nick's precious list I didn't make a list this time. Oh, I thought well, you were then what the fuck it topics up. do we have? To we cover? have to cover uh, what Hurricane are the, Maria. Earthquake. Is there another hurricane, hurricane in Mexico Irma. City? Uh, yeah, there was an earthquake in Mexico City. Oh damn! Do you see that video that people are dead? That building really? collapsing. I do not watch videos of Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> you know that about. I hope it. the tacos are okay. Well, you know that I. Yeah, have. me too. <laughs> <laughs> Bong Taco Bell. <laughs> you care about Taco Bell? That's what I have to say about the earthquake. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> good thing we Moving fucking on. check that one off. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. Remember that yeah. Chihuahua? Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Hell yeah. That I Chihuahua wonder- <laughs> could speak like a Mexican-American. Yeah. I wonder if anyone's made the observation that all these natural disasters, it's kind of like the world's ending because of Donald Trump. Oh, <laughs> you know? that's something. It's like Mother Nature's pissed off or something, folks. Yeah, well, Mother Nature's a woman, and she doesn't like getting yeah. her pussy grabbed. Yeah. 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 By uh, those, hey... By those little hands. And what I like, yeah. the, what I like With to think Cheeto, is happening is that the, the world is imploding Cheeto. because people are criticizing uh, the president. That's right. The only person they don't have respect for the office from Kim Jong Un. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. From a guy addicted to cheese. Yeah. Is he? <laughs> yeah, he's addicted. What kind of cheese? Emmental Swiss cheese. Yeah, dude. Is that good? Is no, that good cheese? He, got, got, he like almost cheese killed whiz. himself. He almost for, killed himself with cheese. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Respect. <laughs> yeah, stop. You Respect. should actually be like... Uh, I think... No you joke. should be standing up a little bit more for your no brother. No joke. I could hang Kim with Jong. Kim Jong-un. He's a hoop head. He loves basketball. Yeah. My man almost killed himself off cheese. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's... Yeah, yeah. I love that, It's like dude. if you ran a country. Dude, if I ran a country, I would definitely have died. That's got to be. You'd be wearing those be like some, uh, some those Hillary Clinton planning on how to fucking 
Exploit exploit that cheese thing. Oh, Oh, yeah. yeah, You got to get in with the cheese. Yeah. You think he got to fuck that assassin that wore the LOL shirt? Uh, He killed his cousin or whatever? Yeah, maybe. That'd be cool. Yeah, that'd be cool. Get to fuck assassins? That video is insane. It is really wild. Like the spray, yeah, and the LOL t shirt. How do you want to get assassinated? Um, so like James Bond style? Borax in the dust it eats. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> a raid ho- a raid can you want to go a nice little tin can that smells nice but he gets in there and his feet are stuck to the ground and he can't move <laughs> so correct me if I'm wrong you guys are saying in this bully, a giant, a, a giant a plastic uh, <laughs> fucking fly swatter gets you, dude. A uh, fly you swatter, yeah, that has paper and you can't move. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, a fucking chameleon fucking yeah. sticks his yeah. tongue out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God damn it. You guys didn't even do the one about the light. I see a light. And yeah, like, yeah, it goes. Zzz. Yeah, and I guess. Shut zapped. up, dude. Stop trying to participate. Well, I'm just trying to help you rip. Bugs can't talk. <laughs> Come on. <dude. laughs> Fuck. Did you know they made a movie about Adam's life? <laughs> it's called, called The Bugs Life. <laughs> yeah, yeah, obviously. <laughs> He's he's in that movie James and the Giant Peach, but it's a different version where James fucks the bug. <laughs> in that peach? Yeah, no, yeah, that was a good yeah, I know. Thanks, man. <laughs> Lit his ass up, dude. Ra, ra, ka, 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 ka. Fucking bug. <laughs> you fucking bug nerd, dude. <laughs> You're a fucking bug, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> the best burn of all time. <laughs> This is like <laughs> what did we call him last time? <laughs> a baby. <laughs> we called him a baby. The baby. Yeah, that was funny. And then what else? <laughs> there was something really stupid a couple times ago. I don't know. Dad who cares? A, Fuck Adam. He's a yeah. bug. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a bug. Get your fucking uh antenna eye off me, bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's sending chemicals out to the other men bugs. <laughs> he's, he's doing dances at them to tell them where his asshole is. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh boy! I'm just gonna like do a tweet tomorrow about like uh, like Trump or something. And then yeah, get a bunch of RTs. All these kids are gonna be like, oh, I don't know, bugs can tweet. <laughs> <laughs> Good. They just do everyone do that at Adam. <laughs> I'm glad that's happening, dude. Every time Adam tweets, please respond. I didn't know bugs could tweet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, fuck! Uh, I love being with the damn boys, man. Yeah, I mean, it was, you, I made a big fat good. fucking steak today, dude. I, I w- saw that steak. I think you're exaggerating how big that steak was. I cut it in half. Oh, how how much did it weigh? I go always a pound at least. It was a pound and a pound and like one point two or something like that. That's good. It was a twenty dollars steak. They're bone in, huh? A little bit of bone, not a lot. Yeah. Small bone. We're ribeye? Ribeye. Ribeye, what the fuck? ribeye the is, the only, is the only kind of steak. If, Do they have yeah, nice marble Unless you're going to fucking season the shit. If you're going to season it, you get whatever. Nah, dude, you need no, that fucking is the fatty best. shit, dude. Ribeye is the best, but I mean, I, when I, you know, I, you I don't, can get away with. I, don't, a I need cut. leaner cuts. I can't eat a pound of steak. I don't like fat. fillet that much. It doesn't fit my macros. Fillet can suck my fa dick. But fillet is like supposed to be the nicest one. No, that's bullshit. That's fillet the way mignon? people say. Fucking chicken breast is the get that dry you shit out of my. No, you can take any chicken, chicken breast. breast well. Sucks my dick. You thigh number one. Right. Well, thigh is better. I agree. Let me put it this way: chicken fucking sucks. And I'm saying that as someone that. Eats chicken constantly. That's not true. Chicken thigh is good. It's I went to Popeyes boring, the other dude. day. Chicken got is all thigh. Boring. Thank you, brother. Yeah, that's my. That, got I a love five that. piece. Five. Five thighs. piece. Yeah, yeah. Me and Max. Five thighs. I love it, bro. Pretty good. I love that. Yeah. Um, that makes me happy. But drumsticks. Shit. Delicious. Thighs, right? I mean, it's fatty. No, that's what no, it tastes no. good. The, the fucking thing above the drumsticks drumstick. are the same meat. It's, it's the same type dark of meat. meat. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't know. A drumstick feels like a little too yeah. cute to me. You know what I miss? 
having uh, sex with me? That day we had the uh, no. At the, <laughs> the, the day we went to Amish market. Oh, what a beautiful day that you was! You bring man. it up it all great. the time. It was it was the one of the best good? days of my one of the best fucking mornings of my life, dude. Yeah, yeah. I went to that Outback Steakhouse so with good. my friend for his 18th birthday right before he shipped out to the Marines. Nice. Yeah. Is he alive still? Uh, yeah, he got blown up in Iraq. Damn. And then he was in Fuck. Walter Reed for a while, and then he married some fat woman, and now mm-hmm. he has a bunch of kids, and he's an airplane mechanic. That, doesn't that happen? They assign you a fat woman in the army? Yeah, pretty much. No, you get home, and you marry, like, the first girl to ever jack you off. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, when you're like, oh, we rediscovered all their love from eighth grade. I came on her fucking jelly bracelet behind the movie theater, and now we're in love again. She's four. 400 pounds now, but you know what? I mean, I can't walk good anymore, and I lose my fucking temper real easy. But we're, we have a family. We have a big family now, and everything. I'm sure he's a good dad. He seems like he would be. Yeah, all those people are better people than us, for sure. Yeah. I don't know I'm making fun of that guy. I wish I could have that kind of stability in my life. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Unfortunately, I, I being have a to father is to being a millionaire. Yep. Just uh, uh, the busy life. You know, a lot of people think because I'm a tech a tech billionaire that I just live this jet set and lifestyle, but I actually have very little free time. Yeah. You know, between the gym and buying supplements and, <laughs> you know, fucking going yep, to Home Making Depot a ham scramble. Making a ham scramble. <laughs> trying to figure out how to make my own sconce. What's a sconce? Sconce is like a recess. Look how light. excited Adam was to tell <laughs> me what a knows. sconce was. <laughs> And it's not a recessed light. It's a light on the wall. It's not like a lamp. It's just a lamp on the wall. It's a lamp on a wall. <laughs> it's not recessed. Okay. It can be recessed. Like Adam's ass. His recessed <laughs> ass. Wait, should I have an outside ass? No, I mean, your ass cheeks are convex. They're concave. Concave. Like your chest. How is that even? You've seen my butt. It's dented in. Yeah, it's it looks like in. it looks like an upside down booster seat. <laughs> <laughs> That's what your ass looks like. Yeah, little, little you get you got arrested for letting little kids sit inside. It looks your like ass. yeah, it looks like an egg carton. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's some guy at the park trying to trick kids in, uh, into sitting on in his ass. <laughs> His dented ass, <laughs> but your asshole is prolapsed. His which fucking is funny. ass cheeks look like the a tampered with Snapple cap. <laughs> <laughs> and they fucking Adam gets the, fucked and his ass cheeks suck in. <laughs> well, pop. <laughs> you know. Hold on. Yeah. Let me do the noise. Yeah, yeah. Do the noise. There yeah. we go. Yeah. Yeah. That's which how you is, know. Adam's not fresh anymore. Mm-hmm. He has to get his ass. He's used up. Yeah. Well. He's used up, but you like can still like a snapple cap. You can still use that boy pussy a little bit. Yeah, I have like a snapple tidbits. cap. There's tidbits underneath. <laughs> you copy. Uh, yeah, I was I was waiting for you to start to say it so I could intercept. <laughs> 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 Fucking snatch that right out of your stupid bug mouth. <laughs> it's my th- thorax. <laughs> snatched it right out of your web, bitch. Yeah. Oh, no, that's another way you die. Wrapped up in a web yeah, <laughs> from a being spider. Being eaten by a, a, a Korean spider. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I got eight legs. <laughs> yeah, you come in my house, I eat you. <laughs> How dare you come in my house? My house made out of silk. <laughs> I eight legs. I feed you to baby. I ate my own husband. <laughs> Hell yes <laughs> Korean spider baby That's For, our new character on I the love show, it dude. People wanted to follow up to Retarded man that owns the Valera <laughs> Well we also did Retarded Elmer Fudd Who thinks he's Dracula Yeah that's <laughs> really cool Yeah we got some good Good shit man Yeah I still have to piss Let me know when I'm I allowed I too You can go piss whenever you want Do you want to cross swords? No no, we need to. We need that to, would be so us, though. We need to discuss the hot, t- the hottest topic this week. What happened? I don't know. Some politics bullshit, probably. Oh, Sean Spicer at the Emmys. Oh, How yeah, about Sean that? Sean Spicer yep. at the Emmys. Fucking pieces of shit. Fuck retarded, Sean Spicer. Dude. It's like the whole resistance thing is retarded, and it's like. Yeah, how the fuck is Alec Baldwin going to kiss him on the cheeks? Adam Baldwin's a conservative. Is he? Alec Baldwin? Alec Baldwin? No, yeah. No, he's, oh, I thought you said Adam Baldwin. Animal mother. Huh? Animal mother. 
Is that another Baldwin that I don't know about? Yeah, Adam Baldwin from fucking Full Metal Jacket. Oh, I don't. I, don't. I know Billy Baldwin. Yeah. No, Adam Baldwin is not one of the Baldwin brothers. Daniel Ooh. Danny Baldwin is a conservative. Yeah, there's one that doesn't fuck with him. <laughs> yeah, Dan, I think Danny, the fat old one. I'm glad that motherfucker didn't meet the Pope. Fuck Stallone's Sean brother is like that too. He's like radical right wing. Stallone is a conservative too. Is he? Yeah. Oh yeah. I, yeah. He just can't talk about it. Yeah. Well, Frank does all the angry tweeting for yeah Frank yeah, for a sly. I want to rewatch Rocky, dude. I had a, a hanker and watch Rocky the other day. Hell yeah. Mm-hmm. I watch Rocky. That movie's it's it's so much fun. Yeah, of I love course. It. It's an yeah. underdog story. It's uh, he was uh, Academy Award winning screenplay. Hey, uh, Adrian. Everyone says he sold his dog. Have you seen those viral videos about how Stallone like? First, he had to be in porn, which is hilarious. Soft core, soft core. When he was sleeping at the Port Authority bus station. But I still think you see his cock. Do you? I'm pretty sure you see his cock, and it's pretty big. Yeah. Uh, but then he says he had to sell his dog. To like make rent at the YMCA or whatever. Who's buying a dog? Exactly. You but you just bought a dog, Adam. I didn't buy a dog. You paid five hundred dollars for your dog. No, I didn't. <laughs> I paid zero dollars. You paid zero? Yeah. That's what your dog is your dog is worthless to you? You so you got the shittiest dog that you could get. Dude, yeah, if I buy of course, a dog, so people feel bad. I'm gonna it. get a fucking th- forty forty thousand dollar dog. Such a waste of money. <laughs> no. It's a fucking purebred. They like it's only fucked its family. I want. I want. Purebreds an are only bad dogs. Ever fucked first. Yeah. Yes, but they're better than your dumbass dog. Why? Because they're fucking royal. Because there's some like Joseph Mengele, <clears throat> like yeah. Because someone beat them, off, beat off their dad, and and put the, and then spit the put spit the jizz in the with the mouth. Mm-hmm. That's the immaculate conception, by the way. That's how it happened. My friend Tommy, growing up, used the, to tell the me archangel that archangel sucked off God. And used to tell me that Mary's Alan pussy. Arvison was immaculately conceived. Who? My friend Tommy, growing up, he'd be like, "Yeah, Alan Iverson's mom, someone jizzed on her pussy, and then it got in it." That's not immaculate conception. That's not at all immaculate. That's conception. regular <laughs> conception. You fucking idiot. It's non-penetrative. Adam, Adam's coming from his stupid world of bug reproduction. <laughs> yeah. Where, yeah. Where someone told me Alan Iverson's mom laid an egg. Yeah. And no one came and spread their jizz on it. Yeah. And then Alan was born. That's Adam, just. Adam I mean, I didn't believe it. Asexually. Mm-hmm. Where he has gay sex with himself. It comes out of gay I mean, sex. Reproduced gay sexually. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I said it first. No, you didn't. Yeah, I said it before I you. I said it, and I set up. You the joke didn't get the then, pun. Yeah, I did the pun no, first. You didn't. You yes, I did. No, you didn't. You I did it. But stop praying. Stop mantis. sucking up. He's not sucking. I'm yes, not he's sucking. We're sucking, sucking up. That's a such a fucking. I'm not smaller bugs <laughs> into your stupid <laughs> nose. Your long nose. You get nutrients of a hole in dried mud. <laughs> you what fucking, a you fucking millipede! Yeah, that's why you got a, a fucking. Yeah, Adam has Adam has legs. a thousand arms, and none of them can reach a small ass dick. <laughs> <laughs> They're all just trying to reach the dick, <laughs> and it's just curling up, and it's not working. A thousand arms, zero push-ups. This is like that Kafka book. The guy who sucked the at bug. podcasting. <laughs> Oh yeah Doesn't he turn into a beetle Or whatever in that Kafka book Yeah uh, it He turns, turns into, into a fly You fucking idiot He turns into Adam Oh I didn't know He turned into Adam Thank you Nick God damn it What was the big topic We had to talk Did about Did something happen I don't think There's a happened. new Obamacare repeal That's probably it <laughs> Yeah Yeah that's it What did you fucking Quote tweet about it I quote tweeted like I can't even And mm-hmm. got a thousand RT <laughs> It's pretty tight Oh, I'm so man. glad I'm not on Twitter And I can just Do things like Worry about buying The best mattress You didn't buy the best you mattress You didn't buy no. it You made a hasty decision That's why I said Worrying about it <laughs> You fucking idiot Why don't you just Listen to things And parse sentences And think critically for Stav also made that mistake He yeah, also didn't Stav understand Stav is a dumb guy Who lives in the moment And has a good Thank time Thank you I'm fine with that Carpe diem Yeah That's my shit I have a good time I got time. that tattooed on my balls 
I my right time. ball's Carpe, my left ball's DM, baby. Yeah. And your bitch sucks them all, sucks them both, Adam. Yeah. That sounds fun. What do you think of that? <laughs> Wait, you think it sounds fun to suck yeah, my balls? Yeah, it sounds like you're having a good time. Uh, Adam yeah. lives on your balls like a mite. <laughs> like the yeah. honey I shrunk Oh, no, kids. do I have fucking pew? Do I have lice? Do yeah. I have crabs? Is Adam and his family on my balls? <laughs> <laughs> his whole family. Rick Moranis shrunk Adam's whole family. They're just being bullied by that Korean spider. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. <laughs> Don't touch my house. You touch my house, I fear it. I fear it. I'll, I'll wrap you up. <laughs> oh, fuck. <clears throat> So I spent some time in Greece with my cousin Leonida. Finally. You brought this up already. He doesn't I never have a job. finished. He, he fucks with his tent. family. And he, he bartends and makes no money. Yeah, but they went on the episode we didn't air, you dumb motherfucker. Oh. And he fucks on he fucks in a tent. He's a grown man that fucks in a tent. To go like he goes outside his parents' like house. That's to where fuck. he lives. In the summer, he doesn't rent a room. He rents a tent and he fucks tourists. In what his kind tent. of tent are we talking about? Like a camping tent. You can't even stand up in it? No. It's hilarious. He's thirty two years old. And uh he fucks in a tent. Maybe so. he should start a podcast. Dude, he, what he a bunch be, of dumb tourists. Yeah, dude. Imagine what kind of, what, who's doing that? Americans just dude. fucking these dumb Any Australian accent. women. Yeah. Yeah, Australians, they're like, a, they're a disgrace when they're on vacation. I explained to him uh, what Snapchat was. I was like, yeah, you take a picture and then it disappears. And he was like, he was like, you should call me Leonida Snapchat because when I fuck, I disappear. Yeah, uh. <laughs> yeah I, I fucked some girl from Denmark one time. Oh, nice, dude. the accent. And she's like, yeah, I have not uh, fucked other, uh, uh, this is only a time fuck American. <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> I'm like, wow. And you're like, please don't make eye contact. Yeah, it's like... I'm trying to come. The one you picked? (laughs) I had sex with a German once. A German? Yeah, from Germany. Oh, yeah. Let's hear about Adam's story. Sorry, I didn't realize it was Adam's story time. (laughs) (laughs) Adam, what else happened? Yeah, what what happened, Adam? I don't know. I thought it was... a joke about the Holocaust or Nazis or whatever. I thought it was kind of neat. Go ahead. What was neat about it? I don't know. Please explain to us. Yeah. We're all actually What's interested. What's neat about it? About having sex. Just as a European style of sex. What, in what sense? And that the girl penetrates the boy. <laughs> oh, fuck. God damn it. What was the top? I'm, I'm like losing my mind. I've destroyed this entire episode by not being able to remember the one thing. No, it's been fun. That I wanted to fucking bring up. Which is... Come on. I should have written being it down. Straight... Yeah, that's hey, it. how about this? In dog beers, I've only had one. In dog beers, that's pretty good. It's pretty good, huh? Yeah, th- I I I remember there was a kid with Down syndrome that went to my community college that would wear a T-shirt, <laughs> like a novelty T-shirt that said "graduate" spelled wrong, and then mm-hmm. he's crossed off. I've seen that and one. And yeah, and then that's a th- classic. Three or four times, yeah. But somebody bought that for him, and it's like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Come on. You know? <laughs> That's yeah. like buying Adam a shirt that says female body inspector. Yeah. Because he's gay. Or a Bugs Life shirt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Official official promotional merchandise from Ants, the movie. <laughs> I yeah, identify he's more with of that. an Ants guy than a Bugs Life. Of course. Yeah. That was the joke. He's bootleg. I was waiting for you guys to make that. Uh, were no, you? you were waiting to go into your cocoon <laughs> <laughs> to come out as a gayer bug. <laughs> <laughs> Guess what? You think you're a butterfly? You're a moth, bitch. Yeah. You're not even a sexy ass butterfly. Yeah, you're you're an ugly ass moth, moth dude. People's fucking clothes. <laughs> yeah. Eating girls' clothes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so a cool a little clothes. attracted to fucking light bulbs, ass bitch. <laughs> <laughs> You're not out there frolicking on nice flowers like a fucking cool ass butterfly. <laughs> You're in musty ass closets. <laughs> yeah, dude. yeah, you're outside yeah, of a yeah. shack. <laughs> What? Hanging out around a light bulb outside of a shack. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. You know, in one of those outdoor bathrooms. Mm-hmm. He's trying to take a shit. You're just on the wall trying yep. to be a leaf. Why do they smell like that? Like like old people. That's what mothballs are. You mean, why do you smell like that? Yeah. Yeah, why do we smell like that? <laughs> sure, I don't know. Tell us. Why can like old people not deal with that? <laughs> Is there your dust-based diet? 
<laughs> That's Jesus. true. That's the reason, bitch. God. God damn. I, I love that you're a bug. This is my job. <laughs> Ah <laughs> uh, fuck Can't wait to think of other bugs you are later in the episode <laughs> <laughs> Oh man this one's bad but it's good Yeah it's fine Who gives a fuck dude I'm really happy I can't wait till people stop listening we can kill ourselves <laughs> Yeah same <laughs> Oh uh, fuck, dude! Damn, over a hundred people are dead now in Mexico. That's oh, yeah, one for fucked. every mattress company. <laughs> <laughs> By night, nearly a hundred and forty people have been killed across the country, including scores in the state of Morelos, close to the epicenter of the quake, and dozens here in the capital, <laughs> Mexico City. <laughs> but the figure was expected to climb, especially because rescuers were still <laughs> frantically they digging out. They don't do out, the LR thing. Uh, frantically digging p- out people trapped beneath mounds of rubble. <laughs> My name's Janice Bitch, Channel 7 News. <laughs> the earthquake hit shortly after 1 p.m. <laughs> about 100 miles from Mexico City. It registered a preliminary magnitude 7.1. <laughs> Causing heavy and prolonged shaking in the capital. Capi- 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 Capitalia. More than 40 buildings and other structurios in Mexico City collapsed, <laughs> including at least those schools, officials said, crushing cars and trapping some people inside. Uh, no Kiro Taco Bell, said <laughs> emergency workers and ordinary citizens raced to the side. I always wish they would do that. The voice, the change thing, the code switch thing with like tragic stories and not like, yeah. you know, there was a parade and that's for why. stealing health care. Yeah. There was, it was the fifth annual parade for, you know, getting a job outside of mm-hmm. Home Depot or I don't yep. know, whatever, yep. whatever. What was the one in Maryland called? The parade? Casa. Was Casa of Maryland the... Casa? Immigrant uh, outreach program. Oh, eh, I don't fucking know. Yeah. Uh, you know, as a white ethnic immigrant, people kind of like don't even consider us immigrants. Yeah. You know? You're a blimpigrant. Blimpigrant? <laughs> yeah. You floated over the border. <laughs> now, I would love to be a blimp, dude. Dude, they got I was reading them. Every like- you go wherever year, the fuck once, you want. Once a year, I fucking- I fucking- get really into the idea of bringing back Zeppelins. Because really, it was the Hindenburg that fucked it up for everybody. Right. But they didn't go that fast. They were using hydrogen, right? They, you know, they go or like something. 80 miles per a hour. A plane goes way faster. Yeah, well, the, the the reason the Hindenburg happened is because the United States was the only con- country that had helium as a lifting gas. Because we had a bunch of fucking helium caverns or whatever. Nice. So in the rest of the world, it was really expensive, or at least in the rest of the world where they manufacture Zeppelins. And they would use hydrogen, which was, like, extremely fucking dangerous. Flammable as, as all yeah. dick. So they could do them with helium now. You could just make fucking helium Zeppelins, and they would be safe and fine. Like the Goodyear Blimp? Goodyear Blimp. Yeah, all, any of them. Any rigid airship or non-rigid airship. You know, they use safer lifting gases. But we could be traveling. Boys, we could have a fucking Zeppelin for the show. How much do you think that would set us back? $1.4 million. That's I've nothing. looked into it. That's nothing. We make that... We make... A full Twice size, that a full size on ads Zeppelin. alone, dude. We go up there, get a little Wi-Fi going, a yes. sauna. Ooh, you know. Yeah, how big is the little like place that You're people chill in? <laughs> You're not allowed on the blimp, so don't. Well, ask it's fine. Me. I can fly anyway. No, you can. Yes, I can. It's, it's gonna be too high. Not up. Not past. 10, 12 feet. Fine, something okay, like that. whatever. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. We'd be eaten by birds. <laughs> yeah, dude. We're going to have our fucking hawk around. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you want to be, you want to fucking tangle with him? Yeah, dude. you end Sick up the bird on You're going to end up in his, my man's beak. Yeah. Yeah, we, Adam had to leave the show because he got eaten by a toucan. <laughs> 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 they confused his spotless body for a, a baby cherry. And he got eaten by toucan Sam. He thought he was fruit. Yep. The new cherry flavored fruit loop. <laughs> but it's actually Adam who's a ladybug, if you'll recall, initially is what we call him. <laughs> Talia Hernandez, twenty eight, was on the second floor of the building, taking a tattoo class. <laughs> when the earthquake hit and tore down through the structure, she said she rolled down the stairs as they were collapsing. She managed to escape the building but broke her foot. 
I can't believe I'm alive, she said. Weeping and in shock is oh did you see that fucking bus crash in Queens? Yeah, that was yeah, fucked I up, saw dude. That. Brutal, dude. I was like, man, that is wicked. And then I find out, guess what? My man, the driver, he's Chinese. Chinese. Yeah, yep, I know. Let's, <laughs> yeah. let's, let's hear it for the boy. <laughs> we last two of the week. Go the on. Chinese guy. <laughs> Fucking driving drunk. <laughs> oh yeah, sixty miles per hour in a fucked twenty up mile off sake. Zone. Yeah, right. You know, driving that fucking shitty Atlantic City bus. Yep. Can you imagine trying to go to Atlantic City and you die? God damn, <laughs> that's a sad way to go. Yeah. Well, uh, maybe you lucked out. You know. Yeah. You could could have gotten much worse at Atlantic. Have you at been AC. to Atlantic City? Never been to AC. Have no. you? Never. You tried to get me to go once, like a yeah. year ago. Sam uh, Sam Pitchell was like going on a whim, I think, or maybe it was Racine going. Racine asked me the other day if I wanted to go. Yeah, Racine. I guess I'd go a with Racine. Guy. I'd go with Racine. I mean, I grew up around that shit, so it's not that. I mean, it's got the beach there. I guess you that's different than Vegas, blood, huh? Yeah. No, I you just can't d- go yeah, the back. The beach would be nice, dude. You can find a nice. God damn it! God damn you're damn such it. a fucking idiot, dude. <laughs> Is it, is it okay? Why why don't you just not kick the recorder <laughs> off the table? It was an accident. Did it fuck it up? No. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe. I'll yeah. fuck your ass if this if you fucked it up, bitch. Um, I think we're fine. Yeah, the beach would be nice. Did you find a nice little shell to crawl into? <laughs> into your house? <laughs> That's a hermit. Find crab. a new house for yourself? Yeah, congratulations, you just evolved, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you little piece of trash, pet. <laughs> It gets sold down at the boardwalk. Lobsters look like bugs, so you're also a lobster. Yeah. Yeah, they sort of look like bugs. They got exoskeletons. They are, they are literally a type of bug. Really? Yeah. So you are one, bitch. You're All Sebastian right. from The Little Mermaid, but gayer. Yeah. But Adam's a homo. <laughs> he sucks guys' dicks. Uh, <laughs> oh, I've HIV. <laughs> oh, I've HIV. <laughs> I don't tell anyone Just like my sharky I have HIV <laughs> Suck on my dick <clears throat> Ariel Bad bitch Jasmine yeah, Thank dude. you You to Ariel or Jasmine Adam's favorite princess Jasmine is had a pussy that's true. Adam what, wants to sleep say? with a lad. A lad. <laughs> yeah. I identify with a lad. No, you want to be dominated by his, that Muslim, <laughs> that magical Muslim. <laughs> I used to, to think he was you. Jewish when I was a kid because he had the little hat. So I thought that. Oh wow. Yeah. I was you just wrong. have to take everything for yourselves. Huh? Well, yeah. you know, when you're a kid, you, you can't identify let any, with. You like, can't let any culture have anything. Whatever. Dude. I don't remember ever identifying with anything. No, no. Just, just uh. I still don't have a sense of self. I feel yeah, like I, disembodied, noticed. sort of. Yeah, 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 I don't. I used to. You're like on ketamine all the time. Kind of, yeah. Literally and figuratively. <laughs> I'm on ketamine. Have you ever taken ket before? Ketamine? Yeah, British club people love it. Yeah. No, one time I was doing. You know what British club people also love gay sex. That's true. Um, How would you know that actually? Because I figured Whoa. that's what you were. No, nah, you're spending time there. Have you been there? <laughs> in have you had gay sex with British guys? <laughs> yeah. You yeah. Do some buggering. You yeah. got buggered. Have a proper bollocking. <laughs> you got you got bollock. <laughs> yeah. Just, <laughs> I love a nice proper bollock. Just get properly bollocked. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I want to fuck a right fit bird. Yeah. I want to bugger a right fit bird. Shat snog a. Snog a, a, a lass. Is that Snog a lass. That works, yeah. yeah. Snog a fat lass is more lass. like Shut up. Scottish. <laughs> what do you, how do you say tits in British? Uh, tits? Muppers. <laughs> British women have huge tits. Oh, I want to suck some big, meaty what? British tits. Where, how do you conclude that? Statistically, they have the largest cup size of any nation. Britain. I love it. I don't know that it that's does? true. Yep. Look it up. I want to suck some British big, women have pale, the biggest tits titties. in the world. How does that make any sense? What do you mean? How does it make any sense? Because a, it's companies a that manufacture uh, bras, the largest bras are statistically shipped and sold mostly in. in, in I feel like I would say the United States we're fat as shit because we're fat. Yeah. Well, you would be wrong. Britain's. <laughs> I, I, I understand you would say the wrong answer. <laughs> okay, sure, but pull it you up. would be wrong. Pull it up. 
Pull up my dick. It doesn't make sense to me. I've already pulled it up. I know this for a fact. Yeah, dude. It's okay. Well, Why? it doesn't Just make because sense. Because what? You flutter around closets eating bras <laughs> all day long. You think okay. you know better? Yeah. In your in your um, experience, when you've eaten bras in America versus England, what have been bigger? Adam? Adam's got to Google it now because he's so upset about possibly being wrong about something that he's never um, looked at. You Google made it. a claim. I'm just trying to see if it's true or not. And it doesn't say. How do you say, how do you, how do you say, so what do you, what's a nice slang for titties in British? Adam. <laughs> I want to suck, suck, suck her Adams. Adam's a tit, a tit mouse. Mmm. I guess. <laughs> what the fuck was that damn thing I wanted what, to bring yeah, up? Are you, are you doing a bit? I don't know what's no, going on No, there here. was like three or four things. That's why I didn't take notes because I was like, oh, yeah, these are big. We got to talk about this. I guess, I don't know, not North Korea. Who gives a shit? I don't really care about this earthquake. I mean, yeah, it sucks that people died, but. Yeah, that's bad. You know, I mean, there's been so many disasters recently. It's like, mm -hmm. you know, that's why you only have Christmas once a year. Yep. You know who doesn't get that right? The Jews. They do holidays every two weeks. Yeah. That's why nobody cares about any of their holidays. You're wrong. What do you mean? Who's I'm got wrong? the biggest titties? Russia, Finland, Sweden, Norway. No, nope. I looked it up. It was uh, it was in an article that I read that Britain ships the most of. Russia, it doesn't make you, sense. You're, it's you're, an incredibly and, diverse and, country. And you said it was America, so you went. Do you just look through I all said these sources no, to I find said, the word Britain yes. is not the well, answer? Yes, and America on average has larger breasts than Great Britain. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. It's still, you said America had the most. You did. I said it would make the most sense that America would because there's so many fat people. And Stav actually said that first. <sighs> You're fucking so you're is. fucking wrong, Nick. I'm not wrong. You're wrong. I'm, you're fucking snide. Fucking look down at you. Fucking. Can you chill for a second, man? You're being kind of hostile right I'm now. I'm being a bug right now, aren't I? Yeah, you're being a bugger. Yeah. You're the only bug that buggers other bugs. Why is ass fucking buggering? I, I don't get that. Buggery. What, why does it mean? Now we're all looking at our phones. Yeah, no, because you can't just handle the fact that I stated something, and so you have to go find some other study, which is wrong, by the way. <laughs> you pathetic. Nick commissioned this study himself. You're pathetic. You're, You're the one pathetic. that had to spitefully get your phone out because you can't score a single point this episode <laughs> with your shit little bug body. You said, oh, 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 something to contest. It's not our fault. We're literally a thousand you times of, larger you, than you yeah, as wait, humans <laughs> versus a bug. Yeah, right. When earlier tonight you thought that a movie with Paul Giamatti in it was a documentary. <laughs> yeah, you did say. <laughs> no. What was it called? Yeah. <laughs> what was that movie it's called? Too book. Big to Fail. He yeah, said, yeah, 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 he thought it was a documentary. Well, because it was a book. Actors in it playing characters. It was characters. a book. Yeah, that's never. Book, they, there's that never been. Into you movie. know how Harry Potter is a documentary. That doesn't make it a documentary. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Harry Potter wasn't about something that happened. <laughs> yes, it was. So here are the countries with the biggest boobs ranked. Number one, U.S. Number two, Canada. According to who? Titties.com. Yeah, here's another article. Germany. Damn, there's two. You know what the only the only answer is? Ladies of every, if you're listening, ladies in every country, send me pictures of Three your titties. Three U.S. non-Caucasian. I will tell you. Four U.S. Caucasian was one. Wow. U.S. non-Caucasian three. Fat Four Ireland. Titties. And you know what it is? It's milk, dude. Because oh. we drink so much goddamn milk, they put hormones in it and make yes. girls have big titties in this country. Absolutely. That's my theory. I think you're right. Five, Poland. Six, United Kingdom. Seven, Nick. You're fucking wrong. All right, man. Are you happy? I'm happy. Yeah. Why? You needed that? Yeah, I needed it. All right. Well, I'll, I have to now, after the show, go find the article that I read that said that because you want to go find... A counter study. There's three, <laughs> four, five other articles here that do not why say do you, that, why that Britain has the largest tits. <laughs> I don't care. It's just the imbecile? fucking tone. Why the fuck what, do, what do you mean? Care so much. You're wrong. Imbecile. You're being a child. You can't imbecile. admit that you're wrong. <laughs> I'm not wrong. I'm repeating a thing that I read that said Who Britain has the largest fuck? tits. We were talking about titties, dude. And you guys had to fuck it up with facts. 
I, you know what? I never wanted titties are a thing about joy, and they're a thing about just you know speaking from the cock and the heart at the same time. Yeah. And we're over here doing math about titties. I we're over here measuring like titties. Adam had to had to derail the show. I want his phone out, and he's shaking his head. He's all upset. I want to do is suck titties, watch them bounce up and down while I have sex. I was with trying the to remember the goddamn thing. That and I, Nick yeah. is still working on that. You know, so let him figure that out. Figure out what the thing we got to talk about. I it's, the show's over. We already nice. Did the Have whole we done hour. an hour? Yep. Damn. There's yeah. a thing I was supposed to mail off tonight that I didn't do. What was it? I oh, don't worry about it. It's work related. Uh, dude, as as executive vice president of this company, it has nothing to do with the company. It has to do with my own personal <laughs> career. So, oh, nice. Tell it us. It doesn't affect you guys. It you affects me because you're pay. my friend. None of the money will go to you. It all goes to charity. <laughs> a lot of people don't know this. Nick donates a hundred percent of every paycheck to charity. I do donate a lot of my money to charity as a tax write-off. Yeah, I consider not stepping on Adam to be charity. <laughs> <laughs> and I spend all the money on, you know, their little lights sort of yep. on the floor, buying him little leaves <laughs> for him and his family to eat. Yeah, right. <laughs> don't bring my family into this. We have him living in a. What are you guys having for two liter with some sticks in there? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know how much he loves sticks. <laughs> are you guys gonna have like palm trees, palm leaves for Thanksgiving? It's very like, funny. Is that like uh, what's the best kind of leaf? What's your favorite leaf? I don't know. Fern. We should just <laughs> we should just end this now. The whole show, really. That'd be fun. All right. Good night. Wait, we have a show, don't we? Yes, on Monday. Monday. Come on, everybody. Is it this Monday coming up? This upcoming uh, Monday, the whatever the fuck. 20-something is? Yeah. Uh, the fourth Monday. Well, yeah, we're, just as a general principle, we're doing the second and fourth Monday of we every month. That show. It was great last it time. It was. Thank you for everybody who came out. Yeah. Um, we're gonna find a witch to turn Adam into a man for the show. Yeah, and and then, a witch. And then after that, she's going right back to his state as a. Bird. Aren't all wi- it doesn't witch mean feminist now? Isn't that like a feminist? There are thing? a lot of women who say they're witches, but they just have black ma- black. Yeah, that's lipstick. like a Tumblr thing. <laughs> yeah, to be yeah, a witch. like a goth girl. They, they all, that just they means all... you like suck and. Yeah, yeah, you have yeah. crystals and shit. Yeah, you're like not particularly attractive and mm-hmm. yeah, kind yeah. of rude. Absolutely, you're rude. But yeah. you say it's because you're a witch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, just like the women in Salem that were persecuted. Yeah. Oh, yes. Of years ago, you channel their spirit. They live through you. Yeah. And you're being a being a mean to men. Right. That's getting back for those the, women for those would women. have hated you. They were also Puritans. Yeah. 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 They, yeah. They were slightly cooler Puritans. That yeah. doesn't make them cool. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, you know what movie I tried to like but couldn't? Uh, the, the Hocus Pocus, The Witch. Yeah, Hocus Pocus, <laughs> I loved. Dude. That's the Witch, movie. I actually really liked. I, it just didn't do it. What's The Witch? The, it was cool. The, a horror movie from like a year ago. No, I never saw. It was yeah. There's a fucked up little. Have yeah, you seen the Adam, can, Adam would be afraid of the movies. So <laughs> he, can't, he can't see movies that he's afraid of. I'm not afraid of any movie. Yeah, huh? I've never been afraid. You're afraid of... It's um, a movie. Why would you be afraid? You're afraid of that one movie where it's like a lizard and he kind of looks like he Hunter S. Thompson. Um, but it's you're afraid because it's a lizard and he's going to eat you. <laughs> what? <laughs> Are you talking about fear and loathing and loss? No, nah, but there was a there was there was like a, a lizard version of it. What was that? What? There? There's this scene where he's tripping Ringo? and he sees l- Ringo yeah. or something like that. Yeah, you're, that's what you're afraid of. Yeah, oh, the Johnny afraid. Depp movie. Because he'll eat you. Rango. Rango. Yeah, I never saw that. But you're it looked afraid bad because you're afraid of it. Yeah, I couldn't afraid. get into the witch. <laughs> uh, <laughs> So that, I liked it, man. That that wraps up. Oh, they got fucking Blade Runner coming out on 4K Blu-ray, and Ooh. they have a new Blade Runner in the theaters. 2069 looks Blade sick. Runner. Yeah, you think it's gonna be good? It looks like bad. I should looks watch sick. a movie or something. I haven't considered what, it, what makes something look good or look bad. I mean, just rebooting Blade Runner or whatever looks bad to me. Sounds bad. Sounds bad. Oh. Uh, you know what? That sounds bad. The other one looks bad. I wanted to like the other one. I love David. You Simon. should watch it. I might watch it, but also I mean, Maggie not, Gyllenhaal. I don't know why I'm standing up Ma- for it. Maggie Gyllenhaal. No, it's good. Yeah, she's got very droopy she's 70s titties. She's cities. weird. Yeah, but it's good for the character. She's she's the. What do you mean she's weird? Not uh, Linda Lovelace. Yeah. No, she's not her. She just plays like a like droopy big old pair of droopy 70s titties. You know what I'm talking about? I How do. The 70s, I 100%. The titties they were hang droopier. low. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And she plays like a mom that's like... You know what else you know, you don't see a lot? In like in early Playboys, they had very co- conical titties. Yep, the nipples. They were fucking like, fat we've titties. We've talked about this before, but Apollonia and Godfather Part 2. Yes. Godfather Part 1. No, no, she had puffy nipples. That's a different puffy, difference. Puffy, coney kind of... But hers weren't that big. I'm talking big, fat m- missiles, missile titties. Yeah, I think that's from like early boob jobs. No, I think it's because the, the bras, the bras shape. Yes. Oh, that's right. That makes sense. Well, I, I, I just, I wish we could come up with different bra shapes to force women to wear so you can make them any shape we wanted. Squares. Like Play-Doh. Mm. If I have a wife, I'm going to what design gonna- custom bras in my woodworking shop that she will be forced <laughs> to wear to create breasts of all shapes. I you think know? I like round. I I like a nice long tit, <laughs> like, a, like a big TV a remote. Like a, like, oh yeah, you know, like with a, buttons on it. A banana. That's titty. I'm talking about like 35 nipples. Oh, all on you the top. want buttons? Yeah, dude. Will they do things? Uh, or are they cosmetic mostly? Yeah. Uh, I mean, if I could figure out a way to wire up my wife, you know, <laughs> get some fucking wires in that body of hers. Into it through her pussy. Have her, we're talking about the perfect woman here. So six yes. tits, Would all you? remote shaped. They all hook up to my AV receiver. <laughs> Brain removed. Pulled directly out of her fucking body. What are we putting there instead? That's right, folks. A pussy. <laughs> pussy. <laughs> right on top of her head. I play with my remotes and I fuck the top of her head. <laughs> and the ass you, get oh, another, yeah. you tr- replace the asshole with another pussy mm. Put some nipples on those ass cheeks Oh yes An ass titty You're sucking those ass titties yeah. <laughs> Feet cut them off Replace them with more titties <laughs> She's bouncing Yeah I don't, I don't know what you're thinking But what about the companionship aspect If she doesn't have a brain Fuck that shit. Now we're talking. Mm-hmm. Who ca- who needs companionship? I've got aggression. Mm-hmm. You know? I'm angry about the world. You don't need friends. No. You can just stay angry. You need some it. ass titties to fuck. Yeah, that's cool. It is cool. You know? Who needs who needs the companionship of a woman when I got my trusty C B radio? <laughs> <laughs> and the other guys out there on the road that really knows what it, what it means mm-hmm. to do your own surgery. That's right. On your spouse. So, would you fuck a real girl doll? A real doll? I mean, I guess, but I wouldn't... Uh, like, if there was one in front of me and I was horny, I guess. I wouldn't buy one. Like, has a fleshlight. You would, like, use it to... to yeah. To come. To come. Yeah, I wouldn't take it out on a date. What if, like, when the technology gets better and it's, like, then fucking the a person? The is still yes. Nothing has changed. Yeah, you don't understand what how you hypotheticals mean? work. Would you fuck a real doll? Yeah. Yeah, but what if they were better? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is like one of my hypotheticals. No, what I'm saying is like, Ask would you it. like, would you pursue that? If No, I would not buy one. If there was like a, some sort of android type sex robot. How much, or how much do they cost? And it was the best how sex. How good does it feel? You could just go like a prostitute. 50 mm. bucks. And have like the best robot yeah, sex of your life. Yeah, probably every once in a while. Just to, just if to it's have a your robot nut, to get your nut. Yeah, because my biggest problem with prostitution is I don't I don't want you feel bad that I you're hurting bad. a person's feelings. Not that I'm hurting the person's feelings. You're making you're ruining her day. <laughs> yeah. <I'm>, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'd be a bright spot, dude. You know, I yeah. get prostitutes. I give them back massages. <laughs> eat their pussy. Watch some. Watch the Office together. You eat them out. Yeah. Can, can you eat an, a prostitute's pussy? I feel like it would be strange. I feel like you have to pay more. Because I, I do enjoy... What do you mean you feel like? You know this for sure. Yeah, yeah. Tell us from your personal experience. I've here. never I've never eaten a prostitute's pussy before. <laughs> Why? Are you afraid? <laughs> That's the scary. Sounds like somebody's a scaredy cat. God damn. That's I scary. Love, I love that we had to make you say the f- sentence, I've never eaten a prostitute's <laughs> pussy before. Yeah, you put yourself in that situation <laughs> by wandering into that web. <laughs> Luckily it's a metaphorical one A literal web would kill you Yeah Well I guess we should end the show Yeah it's about time yeah. <laughs> Yep 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 Yep